Karibuni tena. Thank you for stopping by. Uh, thank you for coming to this live vlog that I am about to do here. I am about to share an experience I got today at the dentist. And there is something I'm trying to finish here. Okay. So, I think I'll just start. This is a live vlog that I'm doing, but it will be going up on the channel. I figured that this is a very easy and way to do the videos because you get to do them live if you have people who are online you can interact with them as you go and it's easy you don't have to edit you know when you're doing the behind the scenes you guys you don't even know you have no idea how much work that goes behind the screen the cut the repetition so i'm trying to avoid a lot of work of editing so that's why i am opting that i will be sometimes doing my vlogs live so that I just get it out of the way uh, and because I want to be as real as it, as I can I don't want to go through that hassle okay I'll be going through it sometimes but I don't want to be I want to also experience this live vlog interacting live chatting catching up with my audience and those kind of things eh? so today was um so today thursday what's the date i don't even know we won't even go there so today i was supposed to be going to my dentist i did i started the process of root canal last week and if you've been through that process you know it does not take only one it's not a one session kind of a process you have to go back uh, you have to go the first, start the process, then after a week or two, you go back again now to finish up the process. So I, I went for the first process, or rather to start the process last week. So the process is already uh, in progress, or rather we're already doing it. And today I was supposed to be going back and finish up the thing, seal the thing, and forget about it. And... Uh, Last week when I went there, I what do you say? We went early in the morning and there were so many people at the dentist. So today I had gone prepared mentally and physically that I was going to be at the reception for a longer period. I carried my phone; it was fully charged. Even when I sat at the uh, I mean reception, I even asked for Wi-Fi because I knew here today I watch movie one, two, three. Yeah, I was so sure I'll be watching movies as I wait for my turn to come. So. Even in my head, I didn't have any other plans. I knew I was just going to be at the dentist like I did last last week the whole day. So I went there. Kufika, hakukuwa na watuengi. So nikafika and after some minutes I was called. And my, uh, my, my dentist told me that we won't be doing the, we won't be finishing up the process today. So... He also suggested that we give it an hour week and we will look at it next week. That is next Thursday. So today I didn't even do that process. Or rather, we didn't finish up the process. Um, I don't want to go through the process of how they do it. They kill the nerves, put dawa upandani, they seal it. Then you go after a week or two, they remove the seal, remove the dawa, clean the tooth, and now again put the filler such eh? na explaining kama mini dentist i don't even know what it is wanafanyanga 
So, so kuambiwa, uh, we won't be doing the, we won't be removing the tooth. I mean, we won't be filling the tooth or finishing up with the tooth. I was so like, aya, eh, ushe bila mpango, because I was like, now where do I go? What do I do with my time? <laughs> like, mentally, I had come prepared that I'm, I'll be here for a long while, at least mpaka labda late afternoon. So naambiwa, nafika na niambia, oh, we will look at it next week. I'm like, God, sasa nitafanya nini? What am I going to do with myself? Where am I even going? Randomness in town. Have you ever walked aimlessly, eh? That's what I was doing. I walked out of that place. Okay, a little bit frustrated because that process, your process, Sira, you see, and I just wanted to get over and done with it, uh, with this week. Eh? So, uh, it was just you Nikitu I have to keep thinking for the whole of this week how we are going to finish up that process. Anywho, I was walking in the streets of Nairobi aimlessly. Aimlessly because I didn't have any other plan. I was like, do I call my Uber? Do I go home now? Should I go somewhere eat and uh, should I go somewhere sit and eat, take coffee? And I was like, no, because of this Corona thing, I'm still scared of sitting in public spaces. So I was like, now what do I do with my time? So I'm just walking along the streets, thinking, trying to think, what do I do with my time? And I was like, ah, should I go shopping? Oh, but I remember, then I remember that there are some things I don't have. You remember when we did the previous uh, live stream, uh, when I was doing the makeup, there were some products that I ran out of and I needed to replace them or rather buy new ones. But I just didn't want to go to the cosmetic shop and uh, just buy things out of, the, uh, out of my head. I normally like to have a list and a list from the most important to the least you know, in that order. So I didn't have a list. And I was like, now what do I do? Okay. Eventually, I made up my mind and was like, I'm going to go to the Super Cosmetics. Super Cosmetics, it's along Mamangina Street. Is it Mamangina Street? Uh, that's where I normally get my cosmetics. Uh, my cosmetics, that is the foundation. That's where I normally get my um, concealer, lippies. You know, I hear they have, or rather I trust and I know because I hear or rather, okay, they have legit products. Eh? They have legit products from different companies. I am a Maybelline person and they have uh, Black Opal, they have uh, Revlon, they have other small, small, small things that you're going to see in my Kamini hall today. So I went in, uh, I went in and uh, I decided to buy some of the things that were on top of my head. On top of my head, I mean like things that I need like right right now. Niki Karibia Ivi Kidogo, you'll see, uh, and like an, I had also mentioned last week, I am in that week, the bad hair week. Yeah? And hakuna kitumbaya kama hizi la imzabandika zikianza kumuka Ivi, you see? Okay, they're not coming off with the hair, but you know, they've gone loose. Eh? Eh, they are here, hallelujah, in, in the air. So that kind of free lying and free, free lying in a kind of way, especially so I don't know what you can see, tunanzanga mpaka kujipiga, kupiga, kubend. I hate it. I hate it when it gets to this stage, when they're getting bad, tunanza mpaka kujikunja, ah, zinabosana. So because of that, I was like, I'm going to undo my hair. I have a less wig here. I have a less wig that I want to put back. This is a, uh, was it 18? How many 20 inches? I don't even remember how many inches this was. Eh? This is a human hair less, uh, 360 less uh, wig uh, from Abby's, Abby's, um, Abby's Lace Wigs. Abby's Lace Wigs. Yeah, I'll put the link in the in the description box. This is a wig I bought myself early this year. It's super, super, what do you say? Dense. It's very dense. It's very nice. Sits very well on the hair, you know. So this is what I want to put back because I want to give my hair a break. I don't want to 
go back to the salon na siji kusuka lines ama kusuka braids i want to give my hair a break from exposure nitaiweka tu lines alafu nitarudisha my wig so i was like i needed uh, i needed uh, i needed a super stay or rather i needed um glue i needed glue so, so that i can keep this beautiful beautiful lace of mine in position eh? Eh, without kukuwa na to lift in i know it's a uh, inaitwaje you can wear it without uh, the glue but after sometimes you find huwa kana jinua kidogo hivi hapa mbele eh? so you okay we all know it's human hair but you just don't want it to be that obvious that in human hair so you want to glue it glue it ikae ni kama it stick kwa kichwa so i got this i okay i just want to admire that thing again look how beautiful it is hmm siju kama unaona vile mimi naiona but from where i am standing hmm inakata poa hmm i said i got this wig from abis Less sweets. Abby's less sweets, eh? It's in somewhere in town a long tomboy. Okay. I'm so bad with with streets. I'm just going to keep quiet, but you'll find uh, the link to the shop in this comments uh, in the description bo box below. So, nikaingia kwa uh, kwa what do you say? Super cosmetic shop, nikaanza kufanya my rounds and this is what I first of all got. My aim was not to spend a lot of money because I know I'm going back and I'll be needing and buying a lot of things because obviously I need some stuff but this time I just wanted to go in and don't uh, without spending a lot of money and getting out with very few and things that I need now at the moment and because I've just talked about the wig I bought the got to be got to be glued Blasting, okay, blasting freeze spray yeah, for scrimping hold. I've used the got to be glued glue before, but I've never used the um, I've never used this spray. So I was like, I'm going to get myself the spray. Nijaribu now the wig now that to konyumbani and less time in the office. I'll try this one. I'll see how it goes. Yeah. So that's the first thing I bought. Ah, the other thing I bought eh, is this two little things here. These two little small hair bands. Eh? You'll notice, you'll notice that uh, sometimes the human hair can be messy, can be all over the place. It needs to be controlled. It needs to be put together. And then kawaida big, the kawaida big... Um, Kind the big hair bands don't hold it in position visually. So you need the teeny tiny ones. And that's what I got. So I got a bunch of them. So these are just things that I need right now, right now. Eh? So I just bought Kidogo things. And then I bought a clip. Look how pretty that clip is. Yay! Isn't it just beautiful? Beautiful. It's a beauty. It's a very it's a plastic. It's plastic, yeah. And it's very smooth, so I feel like when it will be going under the hair, it will be a look. It can even go to this. It can even go under this one. It can even go under this one with very little, without hurting, or rather, are you missing? So it's very pretty, pretty hair clip that I got from them. The pink one. They had in so many colors, but I chose the black one. I mean the pink one. Because I just felt gully, I was just feeling gully today. Then the next two things that I got you guys, Mimi Siji watu a gel to nafatu kaiwapi, because I have been doing gel for how many years now? 2012. Okay, I started doing gel gel since the year 2012, and it's I normally go between the gel, the stick ons gels ticons okay they're called tips gels and tips gels and tips gel play uh pickaxe tips everywhere so somebody is trying to call me no no okay that was not a good idea 
that right there was not a good idea. I thought I could put the the phone in airplane mode so that I don't get distracted or get people coming in and call or text so that you don't get it in in your ears if you're listening through your earphones because I know Audrey you're using your earphones. <laughs> so the next one I am saying I was talking about I don't know how what what gels muna survive huko nje because your girl right here is not well i am not doing well i am not fine look at these nails guys hmm? look at them nails hmm? what is that hmm? they are very bad this is even nice yani he hata sifai kukuwekea hapa he imengoka he imengoka he imengoka and it is not even two weeks. It is not even two weeks, you guys. So, and it was not even 1,000. It was a cheap, it was not like a tea, it was cheap. Eh? Very expensive, but still zina chomoka kuchomoka. I'm like, what is up? What is happening up here? Now I'm here looking like half-baked, half-baked what? Eh? Sijui na kaaje. So, he said in Angoka, obviously, because this hand is very active. And this one now, it's just peeling the, peeling the gel and you know it's because of the substances that are inside or rather the condania sanitizers and you see sometimes you can't even avoid using these sanitizers because some of the buildings that you go to they want you to sanitize but the only thing they're providing is the hand sanitizers they don't even have the option of you can use soap and water and you know when you're like this you are better using soap and water because uh, the sanitizer will just chip the nails off, chip the glue, I mean the gel, and you will be looking cray cray like I am doing right now. Anyway, so because of that, I knew I just wanted to remove them. I stay bila, I, I stay bila, I stay bila the. The, I, I stay with my natural nails for some time. Mpaka ni figure out how we are going to coexist. Me na gel shuta coexist aji. So I went in and bought myself acetone. Acetone, guys. This is acetone. I bought it. Uh, okay. All right. Ni meisheksa ni mogika. I don't know what has happened. It was not mogikaing before. All right. So... He acetone. This is what the nail technicians, when I did nail technicians, this is what the nail technicians use to remove the gel and to remove the stick ons and blah 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 blah. All right. So it's going to be a while before I okay. I'm feeling. I'm just saying. I don't even know how long I can stand with my natural nails. Na penanga these fake nails sana. Anyway, so I bought this one. Ilini do it at home. I am going to money do my own manicure at home because I know the only thing you need from this is just cotton. Put cut, uh, cut the nini, put a buff kidogo, uh, put the cotton. You need to go around with it with foil. And cotton is something I have in the house. Foil is something that I have in the house. And now I have the acetone. So yes, we are going to do this manicure at home. So that is something else I went in and got for my cello. And I have, I have, uh, what do you call it? I have the kawaida, um, I have the kawaida, what do you call it? Uh, nail filer. But I went in and also got myself this buffer. Is it a buffer? Yeah, two-sided buffer. It's not even two-sided, it's more than two-sided buffer. I'm very sure you guys have seen this in the streets. Eh, it is a very common buffer. So this, it comes in that. Again, it's so heavy. Then you have to go and, okay, you can remove it. You see, and it has all these options. It has all these options that you can use. It has all these options that you can use to buff and coarse, medium, nail edge, whatever, you know, your nails. So that's the other thing I went in and got for myself. 
And guess how much I spent on this? Okay, I promised myself not to be moving this thing. Can we do a kidogo? Okay. Guess how much I bought these things? Okay, let's go back. Let's go back. It's not going to work. It ain't gonna work. So, got to be glued. The other thing is acetone or the buffer. That's why I was calling it a mini hole. It can fit in my hand. Uh, then we got the, we got the, what do you call them? The mini, the small, mini, 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 mini tiny, small hair bands. And then we have the hair clip. Just 2,030 shillings. I spent these ones, I spent 2,030 shillings on all this. On all this, just 2,000, uh, 2,030 shillings. The most expensive of them all, of course, it's this Mr. Right here. Yes. Yeah, that was the most expensive of them all because I bought them at, um, I got the receipts. I got the receipts. Huh? Yeah, I have to back. So, the acetone, the acetone, this is the acetone. I bought it at 195. This is at 195. It's going to do the work. I hope so. Because I've seen it. I've seen even the label. I've seen it in this nail technician's shop. So I'm very sure it is going to do the work. Then we have the got to be blasting freeze spray. It's 300 ml. So this one, this one I bought it at 1595. 1595. I have seen this glue online on many platforms and it's hella expensive in all those other platforms. And I found the price very friendly at Super Cosmetics. That's the other thing that is very friendly about Super Cosmetics shop is that their, their, um, their, products are, uh, their products are legit and they're very affordable or rather they are cheaper than most places around the city okay then we have um, what else did i buy the two-sided buffer the two-sided buffer this is a hundred shilling i got this at a hundred shilling and super super firm it looks pretty it looks pretty just like how it's supposed to make your nails look eh? look and feel pretty so that's the other thing that was at a hundred. And then we have the hair accessories. You won't believe this. The hair accessories. <laughs> yeah, this is a very good bargain. Because when I picked these ones and asked how much this were going to be, the lady told me 70 shillings. And I was like, um, does she mean 70 shillings per per piece like this? How many 70 for the whole bunch? Eh, but I was like, hey, ni kwa account kama mbe, ebu tuwane kama itafi, petition. E, 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 I was very specific. I don't want to petition 2,000. So just check how much it is. I can be any 70 shillings. I'm like, what? What? 70 shillings for all this? On hizu zote, you guys. And there are many. How many are they? One, two, three. There are eight. Eight at 70 shillings. Hmm? And they are very... Hmm? They're going to do the work. Hmm? I feel they're going to do the work. So 70 shillings for that. And 70 shillings for this Miss Clip Clip that I'm really, really loving. I love this design. Yeah? And I'm liking it so much. I can't wait to clip my hair with it. I can't wait to use it on my hair, to clip it on my hair. Yeah. So that's it. That's the mini haul i was talking about that's the mini haul that will be going up again on my channel it will be going up on my youtube channel so before you leave guys uh put uh what do you say if you liked the the haul you can visit the super cosmetic shop uh on mamangina street their shop, I, that's the shop I normally frequent. That's the shop I know. I don't know whether, I am not so sure whether they have any other branches around Nairobi, but that's the one that I'm aware of. And that's where I get most of this product. So if you want to get more of your Maybelline foundation, if you want to get your Revlon 
products, Maybelline products, Black Opal products, hair products, variety, and they have variety, and they also have variety of makeup products. If you want to get yourself and get yourself spoiled for choice, visit their shop on Mamangina Street. Eh? Until next time, it's bye-bye. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. I am going to come back here with now the main hall, because eh? this is just a... Um, a Kamini haul I'm doing here. So I'm going to come back with a real one. So if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Uh, share it with your friends. Talk to your friends about my channel. Yeah, this should be a uh, this should be a topic of discussion, guys. I need support. Hmm? I need support from you guys. Okay, let me put this one down. I need support from you guys. So make sure that you share this video if you like the content. Share it on your what do you say online platforms that is on your facebook you can share it with your friends on whatsapp you can share the link as your whatsapp status any anything guys i'm open i am very much open to anything that is about getting this channel out the more the merrier and come on back next week uh, because i'll be having a and come on back next week because i'll be having another video for you bye <laughs> Remington. Hi, Remington and Audrey. Bye, guys. See ya.